Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? Elder was gaming here. Not exactly. Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? Elder Rizzy Gaming here, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to download the X Ray mod on Xbox One. And no, this does not disable achievements, so you can use this in your legitimate survival worlds without losing any sort of like ability to earn achievements. So, if you guys want to stick around and watch the mod review and see the proof that it does work, uh, go ahead and stick around for the mod review But if you guys want to skip to the tutorial and just want to go ahead and download it right away without even seeing how it works You can skip to the timestamp provided on screen So yeah, it, this does work and as you can see uh, I can't see most of the mountain over there But I'm gonna go ahead and head over here because it seems like there's a cave and boom as you can see all these ores are instantly revealed to me through this method that I'm going to show you guys now they are pretty dark so I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that and how to make it so you can actually see what the ores are uh, go ahead and if you're in survival mode you're going to have to craft these uh, but since I'm in creative mode I'm gonna go ahead and give them to myself now what you want to do is give yourself night vision effect so you need to do that by drinking a potion of night vision. Now, if you're in survival, I recommend using redstone on it to extend its duration to eight minutes. But anyways, the second step would be to go ahead and hit the pause button and then go into settings. Now, once settings loads, you just want to go down to video and then go into the uh, just keep going down, I guess, until you find smooth lighting in your video options now you want to press a on that to disable smooth lighting which makes it a bit easier to see what the ores are i'm also gonna go ahead and go into my video settings and raise my brightness all the way up because you know that's also gonna help i'm gonna drink this night vision potion and boom as you can see now we can actually tell what every ore is and there's also a freaking mob spawner right here that i wouldn't have known was there unless i had the x-ray on so let's go ahead and see what type of mob spawner this is it is a spider spawner uh, another thing just in case any of you guys do want to play on this world the seed is six eight nine eight five one zero four one uh, but anyways uh, let's go ahead I know the reason you guys have downloaded this is probably to try to find yourself some mob spawners but the other thing is obviously for diamonds so you could go ahead and just hit the yep just oh my I'm just mind blown there's so many or oh diamonds right underneath us some gold holy you can see like the water and all the lava and stuff too but yeah there goes a chunk of four a chunk no that's like eight five lapis lazuli everywhere this is nuts anyways this x-ray pack comes with more than just one feature i'm gonna go ahead and do that by saving and quitting anyways you go ahead and go down to the world you where you want to use the x-ray on press the pencil to the right of the world in order to open the options and then go down to the resource pack at the bottom left press a on active when you have it on and then press a on the uh you know texture pack and then go ahead and press uh right on the d-pad and you will go ahead and hover over the gear icon next to the check mark and then press a on it and you could actually change to uh try to find specific ores or even like you can x-ray in the nether or you could x-ray in the end dimension so if you're only looking for diamonds you can filter by diamonds if you're only looking for gold iron redstone coal lapis lazuli if you want to x-ray in the end or x-ray in the nether you can filter out anything to find whatever you want so let's go ahead and filter only for diamonds obviously because i know a lot of you guys are going to be using this one but there's a lot of people that are looking for gold looking for iron only or only looking for redstone sometimes and only care about coal i know that there's some coal fans out there i know there are but lapis lazuli for you know enchanting but anyways we're gonna go ahead and leave it on diamonds and then push b and then push b again and then go to the left and go ahead and press play to load the world up so the world has just loaded up for me and boom 
we can only see diamonds of course we can still see the um the water and the lava because you don't want to end up you know accidentally killing yourself and running into lava but boom only diamonds everywhere and it is nuts as long as you do it properly this this resource pack is amazing and it's awesome uh, but yeah as you guys could see you you can't see through grass blocks so whenever you do filter only for diamonds only for coal only for blank you will not be able to see the grass blocks at the top so that is an awesome feature uh, just in case you guys are only looking for mob spawners so that way you could just run along the top and see if you could find any so uh, right now I'm only filtering for diamonds so it's pretty much gotten rid of every single block you know obviously not including the grass and the ocean because it's water and you know everything else or you know the ore that you're specifically looking for but as you can see there's another spider spawner directly not too far from the other one we found earlier I just wanted to show you guys which one I was actually on in the beginning of the tutorial for uh, the x-ray and now just go ahead and press A on the gear icon and then I was on this one right here the one that says see through stone gravel dirt sandstone and then you know night vision smooth lighting off required to see ores this one is the one that i was using so go ahead and put that one in on if you guys want to use that one because i know some of you might be like oh which one was the one that you were using originally but anyways if you guys enjoyed the mod review portion of this video don't forget to hit that like button subscribe if you are new and turn on post notifications to be notified whenever i go live or upload a new video in the future and like always the number one thing you guys could do to go ahead and support me on youtube is just to share this video with anyone you think might enjoy the you know mod review portion or might want to go ahead and download this x-ray for themselves so yeah uh, I'd appreciate that very much guys. Thank you very much for watching this mod review. Let's get straight into the tutorial. Real quick before I get into the tutorial, I just wanted to let you guys know that if any of you are experiencing any type of issue or like problem with this tutorial make sure to join the discord linked in the description i have a full team of admins and moderators that can hopefully help you out and also a bunch of other people that are seeking help on there maybe they can help you out so yeah that's the best place to get help if you guys need help with this tutorial the first thing you want to do is go ahead and just go down and then press a on the store and then once you press a on the store you press a right here in order to search and once you press a on that uh, and the search bar comes up all you have to do is type in M Y space F after you type in M Y space F I accidentally put two M so I'm gonna erase one of them uh, after you type in M Y space F go ahead and press a on my files explorer um, so once this finishes loading over here at the top right where it says launch for me for you it will say purchase for two dollars and twenty nine cents don't click off the video yet because Underneath right here where it says buy as gift for me, it will say use a free trial for you. Now this free trial will last 24 hours. Uh, so that's enough time for you to get this x-ray and then go to my other videos, download a couple mods or texture packs or worlds. Uh, so yeah, make definitely check out my other videos if this is the first time you're watching my channel uh, And do those before the 24 hours are up But there is a trick to get the trial again All you have to do is either use or create a new Xbox account that hasn't used the trial on it yet Activate the trial with that account switch back to the account you want to use it on and then boom you could use it again But I would I, I bought it for the two dollars and 29 cents because it's pretty cheap uh, But anyways after you make sure you have this app go ahead and open up Microsoft Edge and then navigate yourself to this website right here mcpedl.com once you're on this website, go ahead and press A on the magnifying glass at the top right of the site and then go ahead and type in X r a y and go ahead and press the pause button aka the button with the three lines after typing that out and that should begin searching for x-ray now you want to hold the right analog down until you get to this one right here x-ray by d6b go ahead and press a on this one and then once it finishes loading there's you know all this useful information so if you guys want to read it go ahead and do so but go ahead and hold the right analog down in order to get past all of this useful information and pictures until you get to this area right here downloads you want to go ahead and press a on x-ray media filer 
mediafire download.mc pack. Go ahead and press A on it, and after you press A on it, it'll open a new tab open, which is the download. Go ahead and press A on the green rectangle over here on the right. After you press A on the green rectangle, it should say save, save as, or cancel at the bottom. Go ahead and press A on save as. And now once you press A on save as, don't freak out. It'll open the remnants of what's left over from the old file explorer. All you have to do is just go down to the bottom and press A on save. After you press A on save, it'll say that it downloaded. So now all you have to do is just open up the My Files Explorer app that I told you guys to download earlier. Once My Files Explorer is done loading, go ahead and press A on the three dots at the top right. And then once you do that, go ahead and press A on Add Folder to Library. After doing so, it should load up the remnants of the old File Explorer. Go ahead and go to the left and go underneath the symbol that looks like a clock and on top of the symbol that looks like an Xbox One uh, right here. Go ahead and press A on it, and then it should bring you to this location. All you have to do is just go down past all those folders and press A on select. After you do that, it should add the user MGR folder into this area, which is what we were trying to do. So after you add the user MGR folder to this location, you want to go ahead and open it up by pressing A on it, and then go into downloads. And this is where you will see the X-Ray Media Fire download. Uh, so go ahead and hover over it, and then press the pause button, and get the button with the three lines, and then you want to press A on rename. After you press A on rename, go ahead and hold the right bumper until you reach the end of the text and then erase the MC's pack portion of the text. Uh, make sure not to get rid of the dot, but if you do get rid of it on accident just like that, go ahead and replace it just by putting another one and then replace MC pack with a Z I. After replacing it with ZIP, you could hit the pause button, aka the button with the three lines. Uh, I see that I accidentally put two eyes, so I'm going to erase one of them. Uh, and then now I'm going to hit the pause button, and then boom. Now that should have went ahead and renamed it. Now go ahead and press A on extract. After you press A on extract, it should begin extracting uh, the folder out of this zip file and as you can see now it's complete go ahead and open up the new folder that has appeared and after you do so you will see the x-ray by d6b folder now you want to hover over it and then press the pause button aka the button with the three lines and then go ahead and press a on move folder after you press a on move folder you could go ahead and press a on this device on the left and then go into isolated storage now when you're in here you just want to press a on packages over at the top and then once you press a on packages hold the right analog Log down until you find the Microsoft.Minecraft UWP console folder. Mine's is over here in the center, but yours might be on the left, on the right, more up or more down. But once you find where yours is at, go ahead and press A to open it up. Go into local states, games, and then Mojang. Now, if you do not have a resource underscore packs folder in this location, don't freak out. You can create it by pressing pause, aka the button with the three lines in to any of this dark space. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it right here and then go ahead and press A on new folder. After you press A on new folder, you want to go ahead and spell it exactly like mine's is or else it won't work and it won't show up in your game. So go ahead and put R E S O U R C E and then left trigger in order to bring up the symbols and then the underscore is at the top right. After you put in the underscore, go ahead and hit the left trigger twice. And then you want to put in P A C K S. After doing so, you could hit the pause button, aka the one with the three lines, to go ahead and create the folder. But since I already have one, it went ahead and created a duplicate. So I'm going to go ahead and delete that by pushing the pause button on it and then pressing A on delete and then confirming it. And that should just delete the duplicate folder that I don't need. But anyways, if you guys needed to create it, that's how you do so. Uh, next step would be to go ahead and open it up and then hover over any of the empty space and push the pause button, aka the button with the three lines, and then go ahead and press paste. After you press paste, it should begin moving the x-ray folder from our download section into the correct location. 
after it's done moving i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to equip it and use it properly go ahead and load your games guys once your game is done loading in order to use this properly go ahead and press a on play and then go to the world where you want to use the x-ray on and press the pencil to the right of it and then once you do that and it finishes loading you just want to go down to resource packs i already have it on let me go ahead and unequip it but anyways you want to go down to resource packs and then go down to my packs and press a on my packs and then right here it will look exactly like this and it'll say x-ray made by d6b texture pack go ahead and press a on it and then press a on activate and then once you activate it in order to actually use it go ahead and press a on it again after opening the active tab and then over here you'll see where it says deactivate go ahead and hit right on the d-pad so you're up right next to the check mark and on top of the gear icon once you press a on the gear icon it'll say resolution x-ray disabled it's because it's on off by default so what you want to do is just go ahead and push left on the d-pad to move left and or, or right on the d-pad if you want to go to the right but left on the d-pad to move to the left now if you want to see every single thing through the ground and the overworld this is the one that i recommend using right here now if you want to see a specific type of ore all of those are on the left so as you can tell diamonds gold iron redstone coal or actually if you guys want to see how to fix the ores all you have to do is just rewind to the beginning where i show the mod review because i know i'm going to cover it or i have covered it in there so go ahead and rewind if you want to know how to fix it so you can actually see what ores are what if this tutorial slash review helped you out in any way shape or form or if you just enjoyed it make sure to hit that like button subscribe if you are new turn on notifications to be notified whenever i go live or upload a new video in the future the number one thing you guys can do to help me out on youtube is to just share this video with anyone you think might enjoy or might want to download x-ray on minecraft or xbox one it's been your boy elder wizard gaming and i'll see you guys next time peace